Sit comfortably on your mat. Your palms are resting on your thigh. Roll your shoulders back. Your spine is straight. Close your eyes and just breathe through your nose and exhale out find a connection with yourself in this present moment be grounded feel as the air is reaching your lung and as your navel is rising up when you breathe in inhale reach your arms up and place your fingers top of your shoulder we are going to warm up our shoulders with a circle movement couple of times with your breath do some circle forward and back Move with your breath, inhale and exhale out. Exhale palms on the ground, inhale reach your arms up, plant your right palm on the ground, reach your left arms above your head and feel the stretch the left side of your body if you wish you can gaze up towards the ceiling and stay with your breath exhale come back to the center and let's switch side plant your left palm on the ground Sweep your left arm above your head. Look over your right shoulder and stay with your breath. Exhale, come back to center and place your palms and knees on the ground. Sit back on your heels and arrive in Balasana child pose inhale come forward and do any circle movement and warm up your whole body do any kind of movement whichever feels good there is no rules warm up your shoulders your arms your hips, your leg and your neck move with your breath freely enjoy the moment one more deep inhale and when you are ready, come into your upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. You might feel yourself a bit sore. So feel free to bend your knee one at a time. Warm up your hamstrings, your calf muscles and your hips. inhale exhale step forward at the very top of your mat halfway look up exhale all the way down bend your knees and place your palms front of you give a bit of stretch to your wrist you can say yes and no with your head we are staying here for a moment in this ragdoll and decompress our whole spine. Inhale halfway up, grab your big toes and exhale slowly, chest close to your thigh and come into Padangusthasana. 
strengthen and lengthen the back of your legs stay with your breath deeply inhale and exhale halfway up release and come up sweep your arms up above your head exhale prayer pose samastitihi stay with your breath lengthening your spine engage your core muscles release your arms next to your torso engage your knees your thigh and stay straight in mountain pose deep inhale exhale out inhale reach your arms up Exhale all the way down, Uttanasana. Inhale halfway up and exhale step back to plank pose. Do your flow, Chaturanga Dandasana. Upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay here with your breath, lengthening your spine. Your hips are facing towards to the sky heels are close to the ground spread your fingers out your arms are straight inhale step on the front look up halfway up inhale exhale Uttanasana and inhale all the way up reach your arms up exhale samastitihi inhale sweep your arms up exhale all the way down inhale halfway look up and step or jump back to plank pose chaturanga dandasana upward facing dog Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, exhale out. Inhale, jump on the front. Inhale, look up. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, reach your arms up look up exhale samastitihi inhale sweep your arms up exhale all the way down uttanasana then bend your left knee deeply hand in line with your foot feet hip distance apart and gaze up twist from the navel opening your chest and enjoy this twisted uttanasana deep inhale exhale place your palm back on the floor and let's switch side bend your right knee and reach your left arm towards to the ceiling opening your heart and stay with your breath exhale palm back to the ground halfway look up exhale uttanasana inhale sweep your arms up exhale samastitihi one more deep inhale reach your arms up exhale all the way down halfway look up and jump back to plank pose do your flow and meet me in downward facing dog stay here for one breath inhale through the nose exhale jump forward inhale halfway up exhale uttanasana inhale 
reach your arms up exhale samastitihi step in the middle of your mat we are going to practice utita hasta padangustasana lift your right knee to the chest left palm on your left hip when you are ready open your knee on your right side find your balance or exhale come back to the center grab your big toe and reach it out inhale exhale bring on your left side look over your left shoulder engage your core muscles hips are square and stay with your breath inhale exhale bring it back to the center forehead close to the shin hold exhale find your balance lift up exhale release all the way down arrive in mountain pose left knee to the chest when you find your balance open it on your left side or bring it back to the center grab your big toe and reach your leg front of you inhale exhale open on your left find your balance and look over your right shoulder hips are square and you have a strong right leg stay with your breath deep inhale exhale slowly come back to center forehead close to your shin hold exhale come back to center and release well done slowly come back to front of your mat reach your arms up look up exhale all the way down inhale halfway up and jump back to plank pose and do your flow and meet me in downward facing dog stay with your breath inhale exhale inhale reach your right leg up and step forward between your palms come up to high lunge under Nayanasana. Engage your core muscle. You have strong legs. And slowly place your left palm on the ground. Reach your right up towards the ceiling. Twist at high lunge and do some movement with your arm. Reach it up and bring it down. Move with your breath inhale reach up opening your heart your chest and exhale down hold it a bit inhale exhale palm back to the floor opening your chest and exhale reach your right leg feel the stretch into your hamstring and exhale come back inhale reach inhale come forward M move with your breath deeply through your nose and hold if you want you can flex your feet back and feel more intensively the stretch into your hamstring hips are square and your back leg is also straight come forward to low lunge and inhale reach your arms up high lunge exhale palms on the ground step back to plank pose and do your flow and meet me in downward facing dog stay with your steady breath inhale jump from the front inhale halfway up exhale uttanasana 
Inhale, reach your arms up, look up. Exhale, Samastitihi. Arrive in Mountain Pose. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, all the way down. Look up, inhale, and jump or step back to Plank Pose. Inhale, Upward Facing Dog. Exhale, Downward Facing Dog. Stay with your breath through deeply in your nose. Inhale, left leg up, step forward between your palms. Inhale, sweep your arms up, arrive in high lunge. Inhale, exhale, place your right palm on the ground and reach your arm towards to the ceiling. Do some circle movement with your breath. Inhale, look up. Exhale, look down. Move with your breath and bring oxygen into your muscles. Opening your heart. Exhale, place your palm back on the floor and reach your left leg. Inhale, look up, low lunge. Exhale, reach your left leg. Feel the stretch in your hamstring. Your hips are square and your back leg is strong and straight. One more inhale, look up, opening your shoulder. And exhale, reach and flex your left feet back. And hold. Stay with your steady breath forehead close to the shin inhale through your nose exhale out inhale look up and exhale step back to plank pose chaturanga dandasana Upward facing dog, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your right leg up. Step between your two palms. Exhale, arrive in Virabhadrasana 2, warrior 2. Make sure your hips are square. Engage your core muscles and tuck your tailbone under. Your knee is above your ankle. Exhale, come into peaceful warrior. Opening your chest, opening your heart. Exhale, come back to warrior two. Stay and transfer yourself to warrior one, pivot your back feet your right knee above your right ankle engage your core muscle and feel the strength in your leg lengthening your spine palms touching together exhale come back to warrior two stay with your breath inhale and exhale out Carve your arms, palms on the ground, step back to plank pose and do your flow. Meet me in downward facing dog. Inhale, reach your left leg up and step on the front between your two palms, pivot your back feet. Arrive in Warrior 2, Mirabhadrasana 2. Your arms are on the side. Engage your core muscles. Your left knee above your ankle. And stay with your breath. Inhale. Arrive in Peaceful Warrior. 
Feel the stretch the left side of your body, opening your heart and stay with your steady breath. One more deep inhale, exhale come back to warrior two, then transfer yourself into warrior one, Virabhadrasana one, palms are touching together, reach them up, above your head, look up, engage your core muscles, tuck your tailbone under, and stay with your breath. Exhale, come back to warrior two. And carve your arms, place them on the floor, step back to plank pose, do your flow and meet me in downward facing dog. Inhale, exhale out. Inhale, jump forward, halfway up, exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, all the way up, reach your arms up, exhale, Samastiti. Release your arms next to your body, arriving in mountain pose. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale all the way down. Uttanasana. Inhale halfway up and jump back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale upward facing dog. Exhale downward facing dog. Inhale right leg up. Step between your two palms. Reach your arms up. High lunge. Anjanayasana and place your palms front of your chest. Exhale, twist on your right and your left shoulder is touching the outside of your right knee. Look over your right shoulder and if it's in your practice, place your left palm next to your right and reach your right arm towards the ceiling arrive in reward side angle parivritta parshvakonasana this posture is wonderful to stimulate the abdominal organs improve balance increase stamina and improves digestion exhale place the palm together look down and when you are ready, step in the front, your left meet with your right. Revolve chair pose, Parivrita Utkatasana. Exhale, unwind your upper body, arrive in Utkatasana, hold. Exhale, release all the way down. Inhale, reach your arms up, look up. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, halfway up and jump back to Chaturanga Tandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg up, step forward. Lift your arms up above your head, high lunge. Place your palms front of your chest in Anjali Mudra. Twist your torso on the left side and your right shoulder is touching the outside of your left knee. Look up and if you wish and if it's in your practice, place your palm on the ground and reach your left arm towards to the ceiling. Look up. Revolve side angle. Paravrita Parshvakonasana. Strengthen and stretch the legs, knees, ankles. Stretch the groins, spine, chest and lungs 
and your shoulders. Inhale, exhale, look down, palms touching together. And when you are ready, inhale and exhale, step next to your left. Arrive in twisted chair pose. Exhale, unwind. Chair pose, Utkatasana. Hold, stay with your breath. Exhale, release. Inhale, reach your arms up, look up. Exhale, all the way down, Uttanasana. Inhale, halfway, look up. Exhale, jump back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your right leg up, step forward. And step your feet apart wider than your hips. Toes turn in. Strengthening your spine halfway up, palms on the middle and hinge from your hips, arrive in wide-legged forward bend, Prasarita Padottasana. Keep your weight forward so hips and ankles stay in line. Both legs are active and stay with your breath. Deeply inhale through your nose, exhale out. One more deep inhale, exhale halfway look up, place your palms on your hips, come up, reach your arms on the side and place them behind your back, interlace your fingers and when you are ready exhale, come all the way down, Prasarita Padottasana C. Strengthen and lengthen the body, align the spine, strengthen the legs, ankles and open the shoulders. Stay with your breath, deeply inhale through your nose, exhale out. One more deep inhale, exhale slowly with control, come back. Reach your arms on the side and come front of your mat. Reach your arms up. Inhale, exhale all the way down. Inhale halfway up and jump back to plank pose. Do your flow and meet me in downward facing dog. Stay with your breath deeply in. Inhale, reach your right leg up. Inhale, step with your left feet apart wider than your hips. Toes are facing outward. Reach your arms up and exhale, squat in goddess pose with cactus arms. Deep inhale and exhale, do some movement with your arms. Reach your right and your left. Move with your breath, feel the energy into your muscles, into your body. Inhale. Exhale, come back to cactus arm. Shift your weight on your right side. Bend your knee. Pivot the toes of your bent knee outward, arrive in Skandasana, side lunge. Keep your opposite leg straight and flex your foot toes. Exhale, come back to center and let's switch side. Change your shift on your left. Flex your right feet back. And feel the stretch in your inner thigh. Slowly wiggling your feet, bring them close together. 
arrive in garland pose malasana elbows are pressed against the inner knees and palms are together in anjali mudra front of your chest the knees resist the elbows to help lengthen the front torso inhale reach your right arm up and let's do some movement again with your breath reach your left arm towards to the ceiling and let's switch side opening your heart opening your chest and move with your breath If it's in your practice, do your bind behind your back or just stay in Malasana with your steady and calm breath. One more deep inhale, exhale, release. Let's switch side. Lift your left arm towards to the sky and do your bind. Close your eyes, stay with your breath. One more deep inhale, exhale, unbound your arms. Place your palms front of your chest and when you're ready, lift yourself up. Reach your arms up and step forward. Inhale, reach your arms up exhale all the way down inhale halfway look up and do your flow one more deep inhale exhale out and jump forward sit on your mat in Dandasana, straightening your spine and your legs. Then bend your right knee and place the bottom of your heel as high as possible against the inner part of your thigh. Center your chest, your belly over your extended leg, lengthening your spine, arms overhead and take a bind by catching your wrist. Jano Shirshasana, head to knee. Feel the stretch in your hamstrings, in your shoulders. And stay with your steady breath. Deeply in your nose. Exhale out. Slowly come back to the center. Extend your right leg and let's change side. Bend your left knee, reach your arms up and hinge from your hips. Hips are square and with a straight spine, head close to the toe. If you can do your bind, feel the stretch in your hamstring in your spine, in your shoulders. Stay with your breath. Deeply inhale. You can use Ujjayi breath. And exhale out. Slowly come back to center. Reach your arms up extend your legs and then wide your leg as wide as you can arrive into Upavishta Konasana and when you are ready reach your arms up lengthening your spine twist your torso on your right side look over your right shoulder Reach your arms above your head and catch your big toe if you can. Feel the stretch 
the right side of your body. Parshva Upavishta Konasana, Revolve Seated Side Stretch. Exhale, come back to center, let's switch side. Reach your left arm above your head, head close to the knee. Opening your chest and look over your left shoulder. Feel the stretch in your leg, your inner thigh. And stay with your breath. Exhale, come back to center. Reach your arms forward and hinge from your hips. Chest close to the floor. Forehead close to the ground. Seated wide-legged forward bend. Upavishta Konasana. Flex your feet back. Both legs are straight. Exhale, slowly come back. Sit up and bring your knees closer to each other. And let's do some warm-up and releasing any tension from your lower back, from your hips, from side to side. Move with your breath, one side to another. Opening your chest, your heart. And then exhale, come back to center. Scoop forward. Slowly lower your upper body down. Your arms are resting next to your body. Legs are hip distance apart interlace your fingers underneath your butt exhale send your hips up the back of the neck rest on the floor gaze is up front of you bridge pose Setu Badha Sharvangasana feel the stretch in your neck your chest and spine. Slowly send your hips back on the ground and rest. Second round, when you are ready, push yourself away again from your mat. Stay with your breath and enjoy the benefit of this wonderful posture to reduce anxiety and insomnia. One more deep inhale and exhale slowly lowering down. Exhale, reach your arms above your head and place the palms next to your ears. If it's in your practice, push yourself up in full wheel Urdhva Darunasana. It's a wonderful posture to open your heart, strengthen your whole upper body. Strengthen your legs and your arms. Release tension from your neck, from your whole body. Stay with your breath. Deeply in your nose and out. Exhale slowly with control, lowering yourself down on your mat. Bring your knees close to your heart, give yourself a hug and rock side to side to massage your lower back. Scoop forward on your middle of your mat. We are going to practice Halasana. First reach your legs towards to the sky and send them back over your head. Hands are supporting the lower back or extended on the floor and interlace your fingers. Opening your shoulder, the neck is straight, chin is stuck. Do not look to the side as it might injure the neck. The gaze is inward, towards to your navel. Calm your brain 
and relieve any stress. Exhale, bend your knees, place them on the floor next to your ears. Give a bit of pressure to your ears. Arrive in Karna Pidasana, ear pressure pose. Stay with your steady breath. Feel the stretch in your whole spine. This posture creates a deep release and internal balance. One more deep inhale. Exhale slowly release and reach your legs. Place your palms on your lower back and slowly send your legs up in supported shoulder stand Shalamba Sharvangasana The legs are fully extended and the toes are active The hands are either supported back or extended up by the side body Gazes inward or towards to your toes Steady deep breath through your nose Exhale, release and slowly lowering yourself down, vertebra by vertebra. Use your core muscles. And heels reaching the floor. Bend your knee, bring them close to your chest and with the rock movement or any kind of supported way come back to center and we are going to practice headstand. Salamba Shirshasana The weight of the body is evenly balanced on the forearms that you created with a little triangle. The fingers are interlaced the crown of the head is resting softly on the earth between the interlaced fingers. When you are ready, start coming closer to your head with your reached leg. Find the balance, send them up towards to the sky. All of the pressure is on your forehead, no pressure on your neck. Stay with your steady breath deeply through your nose and exhale out. Calm the mind, strengthen the upper body, your spine, your core and stimulate and strengthen abdominal organs. Breathe calmly through your nose, exhale out. Slowly bend your knee, bring them close to your chest and find your way to lowering down. Sit back on your heels in Balasana child pose. Your arms are resting next to your thigh or above your head. Decompress and rest your whole spine. Stay with your steady breath, deeply in through your nose. Exhale out. Slowly reach your arms above your head and send your hip forward, arrive in upward facing dog, look up, opening your chest and shift your hips weight on your left side, look over your right shoulder, come back to center, switch side, exhale, come back to upward facing dog. 
Then let's do the last movement with your breath. Come forward in upward facing dog. Place your knees down and sit back to Balasana. Inhale, look up, opening your heart. Exhale, sit back. Then when you are ready, come back to the center. Scoop forward and very slowly lowering yourself down. Reach your legs out, your feet facing outward, palms facing towards to the sky. Arrive in the final relaxation pose, Shavasana. Palms facing up. Open feet released. Breathing deeply with each exhalation, allowing yourself to melt into the ground. Being in peace and calm. Relax your face, your neck, your shoulders your arms, your chest, soften your hips, relax your thigh, your knees, your shins, soften your ankles, and your feet. Be in the present moment with yourself, with your breath. Slowly begin to move our fingers and toes. Deepen your breath and do some movement with your arms, your legs. Slowly reach your arms over your head and giving yourself a big stretch. Deep inhale and exhale out. Bend your knees, bring them close to your chest Give a hug to yourself and drink side to side. Massage your lower back. Turn on your right side. And when you are ready, slowly push yourself up. Come on the middle of your mat. Any comfortable seated position. Eyes remain closed. Hands are resting on your knee. Stay with your breath. Deep inhale, reach your arms up. Palms are touching and bring them close to your heart in Anjali Mudra. One more deep inhale, sweep your arms up. Release them front of your chest. Thank to yourself this beautiful practice that we've done together. I would love to thank to you to be with me today and I hope you enjoyed it and see you next time. Don't forget, you are important, you are not alone and you are part of the universe. Namaste.